Guys, I don't think there's any day throughout the year that is better than a new bike day. What's up everyone, my name is Charles and welcome back to my cycling YouTube channel. In today's video, I have a brand new bike and I'm so excited. I'm really, really excited for this bike because it's a project that I've been working on for the last few months. I've been trying to find a new bike and the folks at Pro Own Cycling had exactly what I needed. So before going to the unboxing, what is Pro Own Cycling? So Pro Own Cycling is a company based in Denmark and what they do is that they buy all the bikes and all the gear from World Tour teams. They ship everything to their warehouse where all the gear is inspected by several people. They repackage everything and then they resell everything to customers across the world. For today's deal, I'm so excited man, I, I really want to go to that unboxing, but there's a few more things I want to talk about. Another great perks about Pro Own Cycling is that they have everything in stock. And it's not like all the other brands where you have to be on a waiting list for months. So if you want a new bike fast, shipped to you in between a week or two weeks and it will arrive at your door, this is a really solid option. But quick disclaimer guys, I did pay for the frame, so Pro Own Cycling are not paying me for this overview and this unboxing video, but I did add a discount in exchange of some visibility over onto my YouTube channel. So shipping this to Canada, so it took about 12 days to arrive. Everything seems intact. The box looks like it handled properly the shipping. Uh, and I do see like it's really well wrapped around. Uh, there is some fragile stickers all over the box, handled with care. All right, so without further ado, let's just dive into the unboxing of my brand new bike which I still haven't told you guys what it is yet. Oh, man, unboxing bikes is the best feeling in the world. You guys have no idea how great it is. Opening the box here, and something that the guys at Prone Cycling told me is that they always ship stuff with goodies. And this is not a YouTube influencer goodie package. Like they really always add a few things uh, when you buy a frame from them or you buy a full bike from them, you're gonna see some surprise. And here, a little bubble head there from, this This must be like 10 years old if not more. We have a team dimension data, it looks like a beer cooler. A little quick step <laughs> miniature jersey. Nice books, Africa's first tour de France. Oh, that looks nice. Really good photography in there. A bag to uh, put air in it. I don't know, we'll check it out. Cards from all the NTT riders. That's great. Another keychain from Team Sky. That's really nice. A Wahoo Waddle bottle. That's great. All right, now to the good stuff. So as we can see here, I just took all of the paper out and it, everything looks well packaged. Um, the frame is all bubble wrap. Gonna take a deeper look at that. Let's start with the cockpit, yes. I wanna see that cockpit for sure. Always be careful when you use a knife, unboxing stuff. Uh, you do not want to cut into the carbon of the frame. Woo! That's a nice cockpit we got there. Whoa! This looks so fast. A lot of adjustment there. I'll be able to really dial this for <laughs> for my position, really cool to have here. When you see this, I feel it kind of gave away what bike I'm going for. I'm going with the TT bike, but you still don't know which brand it is and from which team it was owned before. Let's go with the saddle as well. Boom, here we have the TT saddle that is a uh, Syncross. Never heard of that brand. I love the fact that it's a short nose saddle and there's a lot of adjustment here. Uh, for me to really dial in my position. It's a time trial bike, so it's really need to be customizable to my body shape. And I'll make sure that the saddle is either as forward as it needs or as uh, backwards as it needs. Next, we have, what is this? That looks like the fork. Everything is really nicely wrapped as, uh, as you guys can see here. Woo -hoo -hoo! That is, <laughs> oh, this is such a nice fork. I've never seen something like that before. Holy sh! Everything is in there. It looks like everything is already greased. Uh, the brakes is also integrated. Man, that looks really good. That looks really, really good. And now, the piece of resistance, the the the, the cerise on the Sunday. <laughs> La cerise du Sunday, how we say in French. I don't know if it's an expression in English. The Cherry on the Sunday. Yes, that's what that's what it is. And it's 
the bike frame. Oh my god. This looks so good. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Would you look at this? Holy sh That is unreal. I don't know what to say guys. This frame is unreal. Looks so fast. Looks so aero. We have the integrated Dura Ace brake at the bottom. So this is this Cut Plasma 5. Uh, what's special about this Cut Plasma 5 is that you cannot buy it as a time trial bike. You can buy it as a triathlon bike on Scott website. So this frame has been made specifically for the team Mitchelton Scott for the time trials. So you, you cannot buy this frame other than on pro own cycling. So if you're a fan of Scott, it's a one time kind of deal that you'll be able to put your hands on a frame like this. I don't think they're gonna make it anymore. So at first look for the frame. Like I do see some fingerprints a bit over the place here, uh, but that's totally normal. This frame is not new, right? As far as I can tell, I don't see any scratches. Let me just analyze it. <laughs> Looks almost brand new. So this frame has been ridden by Robert Stannard. So I've seen him uh, on the world tour before. Um, looks like a super strong dude. He's about my size, so he's five foot six. So I got a small, uh, just like him. So that's the perfect size for me. What's great about pure own cycling is that what you can do if you're not too sure about which size you are going for, um, you, when you look at a certain bike, let's say this bike was owned by Robert Stenard, or you look at the bike owned by Adam Yates, you Google Adam Yates height, you find out that he's five foot six or 170 centimeters, and then you can pick your bike accordingly to the height of the rider. So I think that's a really nice uh, indicative, find the perfect size for you. And what I've been told is that the customer support at Pro Own Cycling are super on the ball with replying to questions about sizes and fitting. So if you have any question across your mind, do not hesitate to reach out to them. So after first inspection, I'm super stoked about this bike. I'm a bit sad it did not include the water bottle uh, that goes with this frame. I'm not too sure how I will find like a, a vertical bottle and I don't know if they're universal. I'll have to check it out with them. So how will I mount this bike? So I did order a Ultegra DI2 group set. It should arrive next week. So I can start the build uh, as soon as I get it. And to complete this build, I will mount my loan wheels. And I do have a rear disc wheel that's coming in as well. That's gonna take a few more weeks to arrive because it's gaining build at the moment. So yeah, this bike is going to look fire and so good. So if you guys wanna put your hands on this Scott time trial frame or any other frames, they are now available online. There will be a link into the description for you guys to head over to Pro Own Cycling website. Check it out, find your favorite rider. You'll be able to get a frame quickly, build it as you want it. It's such a fun process to build your own bike, choose all the components, order everything, assemble everything. Uh, if you can do it yourself or bring it to your local bike shop. Good bike shops are always down to work on amazing uh, project like a Scott Plasma 5 like this. And as we know with the pandemic, I don't know where you live in the world, but here in Quebec, there will be a lot of time trials this summer. We're still not too sure about road or crit racing. So yeah, that is why I'm building myself this beast of a time trial bike, even if I'm not a big time trial guy. Uh, I'm not good in time trial. I'm not, I don't have a huge toy in the power. I'm a sprinter and a ish climber. All I wanna do is really chase KOMs with this bike, do some YouTube content and challenges and just see how fast this bike can go. All right, that's it for today's though. If you enjoyed, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already. Check out Pro Own Cycling website. They have a lot of frames for everyone and I'm sure you guys will love to get a bike that has been ridden onto the world tour. So in the next few weeks, there will be two or three videos coming in for this time trial series. There will be the build video, there will be a first test ride, there will be a challenge video, and then some KOM hunting videos as well. So yeah, that time trial series is going to be fun this summer. Stay tuned to that. All right, my name is Charles and I will see you guys on the road or to the next video. Peace.